Warning, the following video is GTA. Remember that GTA is a game where fucking hookers and shooting cops is normal. Do not confuse this shit with real life. If you like GTA, enjoy long walks on the beach, and or have a large penis, please click the like button below. Enjoy. What is going on guys? I am Jehovah and I'm here with KY motherfucking Speedy. Actually, Whee! Sidearms is here. Oh my god. <laughs> Sidearms? Hold on, hurt. Okay. Oh, okay. We lost Speedy. Dead. Speedy's dead, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we are here. I'm your partner oh, now, man. Hurt, oh, fuck. Yeah, I yeah. Get, hurry up and get on, side. <laughs> wooed too fuck. hard. So we're going to be getting on the computer today. Welcome back to another episode of uh, Getting Paid and Getting Laid with KRS Speedy that's the new. Right, that's the name right, of the dude. series now. Even though I haven't actually named it that yet. Anyways, I we're gonna one export. Of my last episode's getting paid, so I mean, we're sort of trying. There you go. Yeah, we're fucking kind of doing it. We're gonna export two top ranges here. I what? actually have. I'm, I'm looking to expand the business, Speedy. I don't know if. Uh, I don't know if you know. Been but, around uh, the world. Don't expand the business. Right, dude. So I'm about to buy some meth, bro, and we need do we it. need some money to do that. So, you know what I'm saying? Okay, let's get it ready to ship. We'll put that Ooh, tracker on the there. X80? Dude, there's a good breeze coming through my window now. Like, I'm excited. It's so fucking hot in my office, but there's a storm of brewing outside, and that's bringing in some goddamn cold air. You know what I'm saying? Wait, what type of storm, man? Just like a nice rainstorm? Uh, under a tornado watch right now, so. Oh, shit, dude. Good luck Not with the that. good kind of storms. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why I like whenever people are like, oh my god, on the west coast there's 30 mile an hour winds and it rained. I'm like, oh. Oh yeah, people in California are bitches, dude. I it's love it here. so dumb, awesome, dude. dude. It's absolutely awesome. So dumb. It was fun. Like the day that I read, like I was like reading a fucking article about how people in California were freaking out because 35, it was like 30 to 50 mile an hour wind gusts. Which like, don't get me wrong, yeah. if it gets to the top, if it gets to the top of that figure, it is quite a bit of wind. But I literally, like, I was like, it's windy today. I'm going to look on my, my weather app and see exactly how windy it is. And it was 30-mile-an-hour winds in Missouri that day, just on a regular day. Like, there wasn't any storming or yeah. going, anything going on. It was just already windy. Like, obviously, once you get up into the 50s, it's a little bit more significant. But, like, it's just funny how much it differs from areas of the United States. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I'm like, trying to make this as ugly area, as possible. Like, dude, go for it, man. Go for it, dude. I just, uh, tornadoes are, like, scary to me, man. Like, oh, I yeah, grew up in terrifying. Pennsylvania where we didn't really have to deal with, like, hurricanes more and more or now, tornadoes, though. which is pretty cool. Um, more and more now. They're, they're starting in. to have, the, the, have you noticed, like, with all this fucking global warming or whatever the fuck's going on, Trump's baby fucking baby seals and stuff's happening, I don't know. But, uh, apparently, like, there's a lot more tornadoes okay. happening all over the world, like, where they're not as common, like, mm -hmm. places like Pennsylvania, the East Coast, and all that shit, you know? And, like, during the times of years that they don't normally happen, like, it's getting bad, dude. It's not just the Midwest yeah. anymore. Trump, dude. It's Trump, man. He's it's Trump, weather, dude. dude. Fucking butt-fucking <laughs> baby seals, man. I can't believe it. It's unbelievable, bro. <laughs> That's real news right there. That's real news. Rip your better comment than, section now, dude. Better than CNN Trump. now. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's going to be fucking terrible. But, um... <laughs> yeah, no, but I on the reels, like, it's getting scary, Overwatch, dude. by the way, which is nice. Do what? We got Commando on Overwatch, by the way, which is oh, really yeah, nice, yeah. dude. Oh, should have mentioned him dude, in California's the intro. We got Commando crazy, man, because every time it rains, man, there's just, like, landslides everywhere, and it's... Well, yeah, that's the, the see, that's the issue with California. Y'all is a bunch of dumb Maybe motherfuckers built, built houses house on the side of cliffs. Stilts. Yeah, <laughs> not smart. I mean, it, and it doesn't matter where you go. You got, like, fucking East Coast. I've been out to North Carolina and shit. They got hurricanes out there all the time. And there's all these fucking houses built right on the fucking side of the beach just waiting yeah. to get fucked up. Like, uh, I mm -hmm. mean, a house is something you're supposed to spend a large, you know, amount of time in. You know, eventually, there's going to be... A hurricane and it's gonna yeah. more than likely like if you build a house oh, yeah. on the beach and expect and expect to live your entire life there it, it, I, I, I would I would be really anxious I'd be really curious to know what the statistics are on like how likely you are to have your house damaged by a fucking hurricane you know what I mean or just completely demolished yeah if you're one of those houses that's right on the beach like it's got to be a staggering fucking percentage it's just crazy though like you can go one way to like one place to get away from hurricanes, and well, then you're in tornado zone, and then if you go away from tornadoes, yeah, you're in like earthquake, earthquake region. It's like, 
Yeah, it's like I East mean, I'm Coast. Sure there's places that are good from everything, but like it seems like everywhere yeah. has like one down. Oh yeah, you know there's gonna be those kids who are like, oh, I, I, I live in uh, Montana, and statistically, it's the safest state. Yeah, because we have viewers from Montana. No, no one does actually. Um, only Mormons, right? In that Montana, or is that wait? That's more of a That's Utah, Utah thing, stereotypically. Yeah, yeah. And Fuck, dude. I, mean, I messed up my stereotypical the, the joke. The crazy God thing is, it. like, if you say you're from Utah, like, everyone's like, oh, Mormon, right? It's like, what the fuck, That's dude? the only thing that state's <laughs> known for. It's got to be shit to live there, right? Like, what's Missouri known for? Oh, actually, for? I've heard amazing things about Utah, dude. Real talk. I've been talking to some Utahians recently. <laughs> That's what they're called, of course. Okay, Everyone knows right, that. Right I've heard amazing things about, like, Park City and all those crazy places, dude. If anyone's from Utah, let us know. Is it Shout fucking as good as people say it is there? In Utah, apparently, dude. it's amazing from what I hear. What, I it just what's got the first paid, thing that dude. comes to your mind when you hear Missouri? Um, misery. God damn it. You can't say Missouri without saying misery. I mean, it's true. <laughs> it's true. But, like, before you were an asshole. Abandoned football might be another one. I don't know. Huh? Abandoned football? I don't Aban know. Abandoned football? What the fuck? The Rams left you, dude. No, but that's what I'm saying. So, like, back in high school, when you heard Missouri, what, what was your first thought? Like, what's your um, stereotypical thought about Missouri? I, I I'm don't just know. curious. Like, really... having grown up here, like, what? You know what I mean? That's tough for me to say, because... I never really thought about Missouri, which right. might even say enough right there. Yeah, um, right. Well, I mean, like, I would have never thought of fucking Pennsylvania. You know, I wouldn't... Exactly. And I don't blame you for that, dude. Right. But I don't know if I ever had a preconceived stereotype of Missouri, even before oh, we I went bike. there to go to your wedding. Right. Because geographically, it doesn't look as... So it doesn't look too southern. Like, it's not. That That's sense. the thing. We're like that... that we get that rap. So I but... didn't give it, like... A, I didn't give it that southern... Southern flair or anything like that. Are we heading out to do biker shit, dude? Yeah, yeah, dude. We're gonna go fucking do oh, something. Ah, fuck yeah, dude. Hey, remember that um, maze right there? Remember yeah, we had a we did a we did a death match in that. Yeah, we did maze. a first person death match in there. That's all I. That was, like, all, right every time I see that now, came out, I think. Yeah, that's all I think of. I remember Dong was just running around with like a. Oh, Dong fucked us with an RPG, dude. Fun yeah, episode. the RPG because I think we we didn't like maybe we didn't say it, but it was kind of like a gentleman's agreement. That there wasn't gonna mm -hmm. be an RPG, and then all of a sudden, oh, out of all care, people. Dude. Dong fucking busts out the fucker. God damn it. Dude, I'm really see, like, like nervous right now because. Joined our call yeah, exactly. Time, all dude. our friends they're just, all just joined. They're like, listening to us now, man. It's, it's creepy. This is this is awkward. Like, now they're all muting themselves. Like, they, they won't even say anything. What's up, Alright, guys. We're just going to say go, something, dude. We're just no, going to go ahead and end the episode. Uh, Stop that mic down your throat. Thanks dude. for coming out. And uh, we'll see you on the next one. Mm hmm. <laughs> oh, man. So, did you watch the. I hope it didn't work. Did you find? Did you watch the Philip DeFranco Joe Rogan podcast yet? No, I have not. I've never even seen. I, first off, I'm not a podcast person, and secondly, um, I'm usually not either. But I fucking love Joe Rogan and his like his state I of mind. I can see myself he, enjoying Joe Rogan's. I've seen one episode of his podcast, the one with nothing. I think I already said this in episode. Oh yeah. Just because I wanted to see like what his thoughts were on the gaming thing, and uh, it was pretty interesting, dude. And Joe Rogan's fucking awesome to start with, so I, I assume his podcast would be pretty top tier. It's pretty, it's pretty legit, dude. It's pretty top, top, top tier, I guess, you know? I'm like, Dude, I am drinking some delicious tea right now. Not to distract away from what you were talking about, but, dude, black tea with some honey in it, man, it gets my jimmies going. That's really weird. Like, obviously it's hot, hot, right? Yeah, it's hot tea. So you brew yourself, well, you honey, have, like, a, honey, you have a Keurig? I do, but I don't use it. I just put it in the I just like warm up water in the microwave and just tea bag the shit out of it. Oh, you tea. use actual tea bags, right? Because I didn't know if you know, yeah, but yeah. they have tea cups for Keurigs as well. Yeah, yeah, I have a Keurig. I just don't use it because I don't know how to. Wait, your it's... CEOs are signed? Oh, that's what. Oh, yeah, I'm yeah, because we're doing bike. I think it's so stupid that it makes you get out of the buzzard, though, dude. Mm hmm. Like, am I an asshole for thinking that? Um, but anyway, I've had like, uh, I've been running a lot recently and Gay. I've been breathing through my mouth probably more than I should been, should right, be. And right. then it's like coldish air. So it like really like fucks up my throat and like honey will really help your throat out and stuff. Honey and lemon. <laughs> what so what are we doing? dude? Yeah, actually, know. you know, the last time I got sick, you know, being like, well, I'm a YouTuber and I got to have my voice. So I, I, I started doing some research on that, like how to, yeah. how to, you know, <clears throat> fix your throat and not lose your voice, get your yeah, voice yeah. back. All I just use honey for that shit. Everything that I, I read that down. said that everything that I read said that tea and honey was actually not good. Well, not everything, but I I ran across like an, a significant amount of articles that said that that was like counterproductive. Yeah, and not to do that. 
because like well, the fuck honey... me, dude. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna. Right, yeah, no, 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 just do it anyways because fuck the police. But uh, yeah, I just want to. Yeah, fuck it. You. I like it. It's delicious. <laughs> Actually, I'm out of water bottles too, so it's like the only like liquid I have at my house that I can produce. Well, that was gonna be my next so thing. It's like is perfect. That I never do hot tea, but I did it a little bit then before I read those articles, and I was like, wow, this is actually mm-hmm. pretty enjoyable, you know? Yeah. Like over in the UK and shit, they think we're fucking crazy because we drink coffee all the damn time, and they like their I've thing is the tea. Never obviously. drink coffee. Yeah, you're you're the exception though, dick fart. Americans, I Americans. Know. Drink, t- drink this fucking scary. coffee all day, and we don't drink hot tea. Mark. And vice versa. Okay, that guy's looking sketchy as fuck. Uh, Commando Let's... said he wanted to be uh, promoted to road captain, by the way. Oh, he God, Commando. To do that. I know, Jeez. he's fucking needy, dude. Unbelievable, Just have to have bro. A freaking buzzer. I'm joking, Commando. Uh, but, wait, road uh, captain? Yeah, okay. Contribution lifetime. Wait, I should make you vice president again, even though I've fucking done that six times. Vice Presidente. There, that should be done. Donorino. So what we're going to try to do here, ladies and gentlemen, is, uh, is a uh, biker mission. Now, pending any bullshit, hopefully it actually happens. Why did we park all the way up here to run all the way over there? Oh, you see that? That guy is uh, hauling supplies right now on a jet flying behind us. See that? Badass looking, dude. He, right? He's covering some cereal ground like that, dude. I mean, that's when you're really doing things smart, you know, whenever you're fucking rolling in you a You want to take Harrier. this buzzard right here? Where? Holy shit. Commando called one because he's road captain. God damn, what a genius. Yeah, all the comments are always yelling at me. Make Speedy road captain. He can spawn in a buzzard. A buzzard, but it doesn't have rockets. Yeah, that's the lame part. But at the same time, I mean, at least it's transportation. It's still a helicopter, and I don't think yeah, it's we should free, though. That Isn't one. that what we were upset about, though? You had to, like, oh, yeah. Wasn't there pay a price 500 bucks or something. Which doesn't sound like too much, but it adds up, bro. Yeah, I can't remember. I remember... I I remember. Remember. Imagine if South Park went with one of these like YouTube streaming services or something. That would be huge. Uh, like uh, I think Central. South Park already has a deal with Hulu or something like that. I, I don't yeah, know. I think you're right. But, I think oh, you're yeah, right. I see what you mean. Comedy Central. Right, right. You bloody well right. You bloody well right. No, dude, I right that South Park say. game, dude, I'm so fucking jonesing to play that shit. The new one? Yeah, if it ever... Like, I feel like it's literally going to be out in the next two years, but, you know, who knows how soon i think it maybe recently i think it got a uh, a concrete no it got but... delayed again bro oh <laughs> yeah it's supposed to be like early That's 2017 fine, no, now last time i heard which is good like yeah, i wanted I, to come out that. and I thought, be... it got a, I thought it got an actual date i'm looking that up i'm pretty sure it has a date now i mean but what i'm saying was is that three months ago it was supposed to be the official word it was supposed to be out holiday 2016 i believe or just 2016, yeah. and now they've moved it back to early 2017. Like it's it's been delayed like three fucking times now. Yeah, yeah. Um, Which sucks, but at the same the time, I don't mind day. because I'd rather know that you know it's gonna be ready. I guess, dude. My stock level is three quarters again already on weed and cocaine. Like I'm almost ready to do a whole nother fucking million dollar export. Are you Jones? Oh, dude, I, I love this man. Initial release date, 2017. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That, that's the thing. It doesn't even say that's Q1. A shame. I, thought, I thought I saw recently it had an exact date. That's a bad thing. Like some... Whenever something doesn't even say Q1 and it says 2017, that's just saying like it'll be I'm, out in I'm 2017. It, though, you know, they could, they could still move it back to fucking holiday 2017. You never know. That's fucking crazy. That's so far out, bro. I hope they do. I hope Look the game comes out during the holiday season, here. and I hope that it's better because it got delayed, dude. I'm oh, okay no, with I agree. Waiting. I agree. Uh, I, I don't want I'm a piece saying. of shit, dude. Not that it's yeah. going to be a piece of shit. Even if they let it out right now, I'm sure it'd be amazing because I have so much trust Bro, in them. Bro, get your but ass in I bet in they want to make it fucking good. Are you on the one on the roof? I'm in the... F- what the fuck are you talking about? I'm in the, hey, in the mission. Why are we going to be in there? I want to show you. What are you oh, doing? Oh, I'm sorry. What are you doing? I thought you were just going to start a mission. What are you doing? Like we always do. I didn't know we were changing the fucking thing with an audible today. What were you saying? You want? You thought what? You look like you need a thought we were just gonna do what we always do. We're gonna do a mission. What are you talking about? Yeah, yeah. You can. You know, I don't need to be in here if you. Start I know a that cocksucker. I just wanted to show you these fucking giant bundles of weed that we've got, dude. Look, there's two bricks here and there's oh. one over here. Oh, dude, that's that fucking crazy? sweet. I didn't know that they. Uh, I mean, I knew the cash that. was already in here, but I hadn't seen the weed until today. Yeah, yeah that's pretty. That's cute. fucking amazing, man. Um, also, so we have, uh, Torched, which we already did, Jailbreak, which we already did. Wait, didn't we do Jailbreak? Or we stole the we've bus done... full of prisoners? I know we've seen it, but there's a new one that I haven't seen, Cracked. 
wanted. Stick up crew with safe cracking experience to go after dirty money. Cut distribu wait, cut distributed on delivery of cash. Be prepared for heavy resistance. <laughs> that one sounds mm. fun. Let's do it. All Let's right. do it, man. So we're gonna crack the safe and deliver the motherfucking cash on the drop off. I'm excited about that shit. I just want to make so much money doing this shit. Dude, I'm, I'm, I'm nervous now because I, I just bought the meth place. So I have $400,000 to my name. And the second it becomes $520,000, I'm buying another upgrade. I'll have $0, man. I'm all in. That's that's what I'm doing right now, though, bro. I mean, like, you might as well just all in it. And uh, at the same time, like, it's fun. Like, I don't even care if I, like, stop playing and never get my money back, dude. It's fucking fun. So. Do you see where I spawned? I spawned, like, way back there behind the fucking clubhouse. Where all you guys really? just got put out front. I was like in the back. I got put. The game actually set my uh, weight. Like it made it so like my character walked over and tried to open up this heli without. Should I invite doing these guys? Anything. It's um, the boy power. Can anymore. But Why they'll come I? and help. I, once you oh, start yeah, a mission, I don't think you're allowed started. to invite. Yeah. Yeah. But with that said, um, I'm pretty sure that they're gonna come over and just start shooting people anyway, and we have commando as well. I'm gonna, I think I already have armor on, you so. Can order a pizza. I'm ready, man. While you finger but you yourself. But you can't. Oh. Don't bother that, that me. That didn't go none. the same way I thought it was going that to. That just smell like piss. Sorry, dude. I just can't get. Oh, piss on my ass. Can't get songs out of my head. Where? Okay, crack the motherfucking safe. Where's the heavy opposite? Probably shouldn't have jumped out at that height. Okay, well. Yeah, have fun with that. <laughs> Didn't work, dude. Didn't job, work. Kitty. You're great. You're great. You were just taking so long to land, man. It was was like, I though? Right really? Like, oh, it was a fucking issue, dude. Was I though? Just an issue. And this way, Hova, I can walk over, and everyone's already gonna be dead. It's like the perfect crime. This fucking weapon wheel doesn't work sometimes, and it really triggers me. I am the second lowest leveled player in this lobby. Everyone's like level 230. It's insane, dude. How do people get so many levels? 230, eh? Is that good? Is that My good, tooth mate? hurts. All right, is it in this trailer? I fucking love this little SMG or whatever the fuck this thing is. The micro right. SMG? So the safe's just sitting... Oh, yeah, it's just up here on the stage. Cool beans. Uh, start safe cracking. All right. Got that one. Okay. Defend me, Speedy. I'll just kill the bitch. Wow. I'm trying, dude. There's people over here. Was she really a bitch, though? Uh, honestly, she didn't have really good character traits. Okay, well then, yeah, that's acceptable. Dude, that bitch just flew. I mean, woman, fuck. What happened? I fucking started again? Did I fuck what up? Fuck, I just climbed over everything. That's awesome. A bag of weed, a bag of weed. Everything is better with a bag of weed, a bag of weed. It's actually what I have tattooed on my dick. I think you would enjoy that Family Guy episode, dude. Kind of a musical in some sense, but pretty good stuff. Oh, yeah? Bag of weed, a bag of weed, everything is better with a bag of weed. Collect the cash, baby. Oh, okay, do I need to grab some? Uh, yeah, I, I probably there's do, a bag yeah. up here. Yeah, there's, there's three a bag of them. That I can't grab. And we gotta awesome. go to the Deliver drop the off. To the drop drop off. off. Maybe we do another one. I am my own bicycle. I'm counting my chickens before they fuck, but I feel like this might go pretty quickly. Um, yeah, I usually where just did... fuck my chickens before I can count them, honestly. There's Commando, he's coming. Is he not getting in? Oh, okay. Wait, oh, yeah, he is. Oh, that drop-off location all the way over in Malibu, which isn't too far away, I guess. Malibu. That's where That's I want That's where to I poo. want to be. To poo. Come on, man. It's too easy, bro. Dude. That's, that's a per dude. I like it. Nova. Too easy, man. That was a man. perfect execution of the rhyme right there, man. Too fucking easy, bro. Dude, expert flying, Hova. You slicing up the grass as you go over that shit. Bruh, you know how I do, bruh. You are good at flying the helicopters. I will say, you understand how they work perfectly. Thanks, man. And I appreciate I mean, that. Better than I. I. I'm sure there's someone who can fly them better than us, but, like, you do it better than I do. Oh, I you, you gonna show lot. off here, dude? You gonna show off? Yeah, you know, I mean... Compliment, you, you can start flying under bridges. And he can! You're saying all this cool shit about me, and it's just got me all... You know, I gotta start showing off, right? Ooh, now we're flying over a vineyard. Yeah, I just wanted to just take you guys on the scenic route. a fancy way of saying route. vineyard. Yard full of vines. Doesn't sound as majestic. Dude, this when house you looks amazing. Break it down like that, eh? Yeah, kind of depressing actually. Yeah. Are you a wine person, Ovid? Will you uh, no. drink a nice wine? I I will, but it's not my favorite thing in the world. 
Uh, when I do drink wine, I like yeah. to drink, if I have my choice, I like to drink, like, the bitch wines. Like, uh, there's a really good uh, oh, local here, brewery like around Moscato Missouri. Like that? Uh, I don't fucking know, dude. It's just, there. there's a St. James Brewery. is a Missouri vineyard brewery, whatever. Not brewery. What the fuck? Whatever. Anyways. Um... They release some some good uh, fruit flavored wines. Like they have a really good mango one. I'm a sucker mm -hmm. for anything mango. They have a really good mango uh, wine. And then uh, during the what holidays, I've, what, they have what I've a really is good. All the bitch flavor stuff's always the best. It is. It is. Yeah. I mean, if I I don't like wine, so if I'm gonna drink wine, it's gonna be the bitch flavored shit. Um, but they also do a. Where the fuck are we supposed to go with this shit? Right here. Have right here. Oh, this is tiny as fuck. Um, I got twenty thousand. Fuck yeah, dude. All right. Um. Anyways, they I think it's St. James. Maybe it's a different brand that does Let's this. Let's do another one. There's a cranberry flavor that's released around the holidays, and I really like that. I, I'm a big cranberry fan, so. I'm not a cranberry person. Like the really? only thing, the only thing I have cranberry with is vodka. <laughs> well, yeah, there you go. The only time I ever consume anything. I cranberry. fucking love cranberry juice, man. I will drink the dog shit out of it. I, I will drink it. Uh, back when uh, I was in high school, my best friend, his uh, mom always stocked the fridge with cranberry juice. It was like the only good thing to drink there besides soda. And at the time, I wasn't really drinking soda because I was in sports a lot and didn't want to yeah. fuck up my body. So it was just cranberry juice, which probably isn't too healthy for you, too. It's the it was same as soda. Fuck, so. yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was just as bad. I didn't know that at the time. I'm like, oh, that's a fruit. It has to be good for me. Oh, yeah, that's what um, you think. So I would, I would drink it, yeah. Kids are and so it, stupid, dude. Well, and that's, I, I mean, to be kid. honest, that's how, like, Welch's and all them, they, you know, they market it that way, too. Like, they put fucking big pictures of fruit on the outside, and it says 100%. Oh, yeah. really Whether it's 100% fruit or 100% organic or something, there's always a big 100 on the front to get that, like, yep. you just, you feel like, oh, this is good. It's got a 100 on it. It's fucking fruit. That means it's, like, natural. There's no sugar or something. You know what I'm saying? And it's always yeah, still they, not that they great they put, like, you. made with real fruit, and I'm like, oh, that means there's only fruit in but there. Then, I'm too stupid to check the back because they don't teach me that shit. At the cool. same time, though, like, they try to say, like, nutritionists and shit, which I don't trust. Like, they're just as bad as Scientologists. Um, they try to say that, uh, <laughs> <laughs> they try to say that, like, fruit is bad for you because there's so much sugar in it and everything. But, like, come on, man. If you're snacking on goddamn, like strawberries and bananas and shit, you're still doing better than eating fucking Twinkies and Ho-Hos, so suck my fucking ass. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, there might be some <laughs> oh, sugar in there, but it. fuck you. <laughs> like, goddamn, man. They're just like anything anymore. They're like, oh, that's not actually good for you, man. That's what they want you to think, bro. Should, should, shouldn't be eating red meat. Fuck yeah, the red like, meat. oh, like, what the fuck? What do you think cavemen fucking survived on? A shitload of red meat. Isn't it, like, by the they food? Didn't, they didn't have red vines. Right, they didn't but, have Twinkies. They had by, like, the, the fucking tiger. By the food triangle or whatever, the, the whatever is recommended. Yeah, yeah. Isn't, aren't you supposed to only have like three ounces of fucking red meat a day or something? Like something ridiculously small. I three think ounces so. of red meat is like nothing, bro. That's like, that's, mm -hmm. that's, that's a bite, maybe two. You know what I'm saying? That's nothing. It's fucking crazy. You got people yeah, going I'm to steakhouses and. I'm not speak on this subject, but at the same time, like, I kind of just eat whatever I want. Right. I'm trying to eat better oh, right now. Like, I think we touched yeah. on this the other day. Like, yeah, once, me too. Uh, I, I am trying to be better. Once Dude, summer was, starts like, rolling one around, of those days where I'm like, I'll start tomorrow. Type yeah. of day. I've like, got 45 cool seconds till I can start this. We'll just talk. Yeah. <laughs> I, that, yeah. Having said that, I ate a cheeseburger today, and then I was like, I well, I'm going to start trying to too. eat better tonight. <laughs> <laughs> that's good for you but i went shopping today it so bacon on it. <laughs> it always starts with that one shopping trip like i went out shopping today and i bought i bought zucchini asparagus uh and uh brussels sprouts because i really like those yeah. three vegetables and uh if they're cooked right they're fucking delicious and then i bought a bunch of meat which i bought chicken breasts uh turkey cutlets which are really fucking good mm -hmm. and a pork loin which the worst thing out of those is probably the tur the the pork loin like turkey yeah, yeah. and chicken has almost no fat on it. It's not that bad. So I like to make myself just a huge portion of like chicken or turkey and then eat another big portion of a, of a vegetable, which it's pretty fucking healthy for you. And once I start doing mm -hmm. that, I already like almost exclusively drink water. Um, yeah. So once I start doing that, I, 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 I shed some pounds pretty quickly. I can make my fat ass not look as bad in shorts by the time summer gets around. So, you know, it's, it's <laughs> not bad. Yeah, I'm just, uh, I'm, I'm trying to get into running right now. Like, not into running. I don't want to be, like, one of those running people that just, like, only right. runs. Um, but, like, at the same time, like, I want to go for, like, runs and shit and uh, just try to, like, get in better shape okay, again because it's, right. like, summer. And, well, it's becoming closer to summer, and it's probably better to get, uh, get rid of these winter pounds. 
which is tough. But oh, it's bad. Once dude. your body gets used to eating like a douchebag, you just want to continue. That's eating all like you a want. Yeah, you, you get really... so addicted to it. And then the the times that I've gone really hard on diets, uh, I once you get past like that threshold, you just need to get past one week and you're yeah. good. Yeah. Just once you get past but, like, that, you you're just, like, you'll do and it for then two days you and have a relapse. And you it's really do like all that bullshit that you hear that just sounds like fucking horse shit is so true. Once you get past it, and you're like, you've been eating healthy. And, like, there for a while, I was going to, like, a farmer's market and getting, uh, like, a bunch of vegetables from farmer's markets, which always taste better anyways. There's no preservatives and fucking Scientologist yeah. fucking uh, Donald <laughs> Trump come and shit on your food. And it just tastes so much better. <laughs> and so when I, when I was doing that, like, you truly do feel so much better. And it's probably a lot psych psychological. But I, I think oh, yeah, there's a correlation with it actually placebo, being too, healthy nice. food, too, though. It's like yeah. the placebo effect and the actual effect of just, like, well, eating well, healthier, cleaner, cleaner food. And not putting so much chemicals like, and preservatives in your fucking body. One, one thing I like is, like, Health. you can look in the mirror and feel like you look like shit. And then you go for, like, a run or, like, a long, like, hike or something like that. And you come home and look in the mirror and you probably are the exact same weight for the most part. Right. But for some reason, you just feel like when you look in the mirror that you look like 10 yeah. times better yeah, just because yeah, you feel sure. proud of yourself and it, it's it's a funny feeling dude but right it's nice. one thing I, what i'm trying to get my just fuck it all up down. yeah what i'm trying to get my friends into right now um is uh i want to buy a bicycle and i want to mm -hmm. start biking again man because that's just like i remember do doing it, that as a kid and, and that's a form of physical activity obviously it's not going to be as good as running or even jogging but uh but it's got to be good for you. Like, you, it's cardio oh, yeah. as long as you bike hard for enough sure, or whatever. Dude. But uh, I've been wanting to do that, you know? I go to the gym and ride the stationary bikes just because I don't want to get an actual bike because uh, fuck that yeah. cars scare me and I don't want to get hit by a car. But uh, Right, yeah. Well, yeah, fucking in L.A., in there's no way in the hell I'd yeah, yeah. ride a bike anymore. Oh, yeah, <laughs> dude, sure. But, like, where you're at, dude, fucking that. go for it, man. Yeah. Oh, they just go in the tunnel? Yeah, I think so. It's not too long, though, I don't think. Speak you for yourself. order a pizza while you finger yourself. So oh, so I'm in the works, man. Of uh, I don't know if you want to try to shoot the shoot the driver. I can try. Yeah, I'll try to keyboard and mouse. And try shit. to get you a. Oh shit! Low hanging. You can get it a little lower. Well, there's a. I think the driver might be dead. Yeah, the driver's dead. Hell yeah! God, I'm insane. You sure Commando didn't do it? Oh fuck, dude! Dump truck. Oh! Oh, Commando. Oh, Commando did it. I bet. These fuckers on the highway are savage. They don't give a fuck. They don't slow down. Okay! Um, yeah. Thanks, bro. Mother's ass. I guess you can drive this. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. I'll get it. Oh, fuck. Alright. Now, how far we gotta take this bitch? Why can't I... just gonna I... get in the back of the prisoners. <laughs> Why can't I drive, dude? There. Fuck. Go, man. God damn. Four miles? This is you hilarious in first person, Hova. The prisoners are shooting out of this thing, dude. It's amazing. What? That's sick. I'm gonna call Lester and see if it'll work. I don't think it will, but yeah, worth a try. Yeah, I doubt it will. Dude, I'm looking back and just the gangsters holding the fucking guns out the back window this and your an awesome kitty mission, face. Dude. <laughs> your kitty face. Oh my god, that's awesome, dude. I just wanna, yeah, like, fuck remove. the road. I just wanna look back. I can't remove it right now. That's awesome. I just uh, canceled the call on Lester. He said, "Call back when your brain starts working." Fucking asshole. Yeah, dude, he's a fucking cock, bro. Hey, go back to where you came from, Holmes. Where do we need to take this thing? You hear that guy? Hey, go back to where you came from, Holmes. Oh shit, this thing doesn't turn. And that's, and that's not a sign you can drive through. God damn it. Uh, I'm gonna go to inventory, snacks. I'm gonna mine some P's and Q's here to gain some health. Yeah, I'm gonna put uh. I'm gonna do some snacks as well. I'm low. Peace and cues, dude. I don't think it's going up. Asshole. There, it's going up. Okay. That's for real. Peace right, and we got your boy Power anything? and Overwatch. Oh, they do. They just do, do a hard. Something. So they ego do chasers little, yeah. do like a quarter or some shit almost. Peace and cues just like mm -hmm. hardly do anything. Do you think God, they're gonna need damn. to evade the police like fully to del deliver this? Because that's gonna be like pretty tough. I don't know. I'm driving this bus in first person right now though, and it feels badass. Does it? Yeah. I feel like I'm using first person just makes it feel so much more real, dude. What's the goddamn? Oh shit! What's the name of the uh, the bus driver in South Park? Miss Crabtree? Is uh, that it? 
That sounds right, but I'll look it up real quick. The bitch with the fucking sh the bird Daggy that lives tits. in her hair. And oh, she's no, like, she's sit down and yeah, shut up! And she fucking holds she's, a gun to a, a bunny's good head. For she's like, like not being a main one. She's like, I'm gonna shoot the bunny. She's what? Hard bus. She's a good character for not being like a main character. Oh yeah, for sure. She's an old school uh, Veronica character. Trab that... Veronica Crabtree. Veronica. She got yep, like her own ep episode one time, right? Probably, like, yeah. Like she's an she's a character that mostly. doesn't show up near as much now, but. Yeah. She was in the. Well, that's because South Park went to bullshit episodic episodes, like uh, with yeah. a story arc that. Like an overarching story arc or whatever you call that shit, which I personally am not a fan of. Fuck. Right. I still watch. Like I would have preferred to have like one episode about member berries, or like make the member berries like a. Yeah. Now like every season is like a carrying yeah. on thing, which is like it's still good, but yeah. It's I good, like... but it's not what I want. I liked when it was like, dude, I, I want to see an well, episode where the boys have a sleepover and steal that one device from right. the girl that predicts the future, like, and then well, I can look here's up that the like find it. the main. Oh my fucking god, dude! You see these cop cars and shit. The main, like, oh, yeah. think about it. The the one thing that really oh, makes it obvious how much different it is is, like, they literally used to end every episode with Kenny dying. And then yeah. Kenny would just magically be alive the next Wednesday when the show came on. Mm -hmm. And, it, okay, like, no that's, how, that's how much different it is. Like, literally, it, it would be a show about, like, fucking aliens or something. And, the, and next week it would be a show about politics. Like, it was just, it didn't matter. Yeah. They were all over the place. It was really cool. It was sporadic. You never knew what was coming. But it was always topical too. It was always about something yeah, going on. Yeah, and you knew like, like let's say like the NFL like has replacement referees were like, or something like that. You know, maybe South Park's gonna spoof this, and then come Wednesday, the episode's about like NFL refs, and it's like, dude, they are so fucking on they top of this so shit. They were so fast, like, and everything. Yeah, and I mean, they're they're still good about those topics. Nothing crazy going on. They'd make like a random episode that was just fucking great, dude. Right. And, like, they're still so, really good. There about was that. episodes that were misses, but like for the most part, they were mostly hits, and it was fucking great, yes. dude. Woo! Dude, Commando's missiles are Someone going so, so close. Random. Oh yeah, they're getting pretty close now. They are getting pretty damn close. Um, you can oh, okay. order that scared pizza. me. The guy behind us is uh, enemy to me, like Why with the red skull and crossbones yourself? thing. So I didn't know if he was coming to kill us. Um, my fucking. Is, you're gonna need to drive for a second. What's that noise? Yeah, that's my weather alert radio. Uh, so you're gonna need to oh, drive shit. for a second while I go here. Trade driver's position. Dude. Got you, man. You need me to do the conversation for you, dude? So you yeah, if you want to keep up the convo, I'll just have to run down there. Did you just start taking off? Don't worry, I'm in, but I'll be right back. I forgot you needed to come. Yo, what up, Hova subscribers? If you guys are interested, I also post episodes from the series. Mine are typically going to be better than Hova's and don't have annoying interruptions like a weather alert alarm going off in the background. Um, with that said, my computer's kind of shit, so there's going to be frame rate issues occasionally in my episodes. But I'm getting a new computer in like three days, and I'm setting that shit up, and 1080p left and right, dude, it's gonna be fucking sweet, man. Amazing frame rate, and you're not gonna have to deal with Hoba's bullshit. Eventually, I'm just gonna replace him, get a new person in the series. Like, he won't even be a part of this anymore, it's gonna be fucking great. So, migrate over to me, it's gonna be fucking sweet. Um, stick with Hoba for now, like, maybe throw him a pity view every once in a while, but like, for the most part, just come chill with me, dude, it's gonna be fucking sweet. And, uh... Yeah, I look forward to having you guys come to me. Like, it's awesome. Like, every time I get a new subscriber, it makes my ego go even bigger. And it makes me feel a lot better about my pathetic life. So it'd be much appreciated. And then, and then this is what I said, guys. I said, wow, that duck has a freaking mohawk. The duck had a freaking mohawk, everybody. Oh, I was just telling this story about how I went to the lake the other day, and there was a duck with a mohawk. It was fucking awesome, dude. Sounds pretty cool, dude. Fucking awesome. Yeah, I was feeding ducks the other day. It was pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. Talking about my Golf with Friends episode also on my channel. Um, awesome, dude. Twenty three k, not bad. Dollars. <laughs> not bad. Oh god damn. Buy some there goes security all. Here soon. Oh shit. Are they, gonna... break. Are they? They're taking the helicopter. Oh, that's what. Yeah, they're they're escaping in the helicopters. Oh, dude, this is a sick mission. That's Good hilarious. Good workout, dude. Damn. They out. That was like really orchestrated. That's awesome. Dude, that's so cool, dude. Yeah, Wait, I haven't done that one before. Where'd they go? They just disappear? Where'd they go? I don't know, Billy. I don't know. I think they just disappeared. Huh. Interesting. Well, sorry about my weather alert radio. Um, no problem, man. I was just telling a story. It was fine, dude. Completely. Holy uh, shit. The military's harmless. here, I harmful about it. Military's here, bro. All right. Um, bruh. Well, do we have time for anything else? What? How long have we gone? What do you think? Um, if I were to guess, I'd say we're at a solid... 
30, 29 min minutes, maybe 30. I think oh. we start at like 7. Let's give the people what they want. 20? Let's do one mo do want, one mogin. Let's do one mogin thing. Dude, I'm, dude, uh, I'm down. I, think, I need money right now, dude. It's perfect. Yeah, I think, uh, well, actually, we're going to resupply if you don't mind. <laughs> um, oh, fuck. I believe my weed resupply, though. business. I think I have less supplies with most. weeds. Um, fuck, I don't remember. Well, we can go to the clubhouse, check the stock levels at the clubhouse. Unless I can, can you can't do that in your like phone or your little like quick menu or anything, can you? Anna Jim City, um, club work, club challenges. I don't think you can. Um, well, let's go to the clubhouse real quick. I think it's my weed business that has a lower stock than my cocaine. I wish we'll you could look that at that without quick. having to go to the businesses. Yeah. That would be cool. That would be cool beans. It was kind of frustrating sometimes where I drive across the whole map to check and then it's full and I'm like, oh, wasted that time. Right. So have you... But I guess and, I'd rather see and, it full than empty. Cause fuck that. He hearing that go off, have, did you guys have uh, weather alert radios in PA? Uh, no. I've never even heard of that shit. Yeah, so that's what I was wondering. <laughs> like, there's probably going to be a lot of people that are like, what the fuck? Maybe some What's people that I just radio? never did. Or... Uh, in Missouri, it's a pretty common thing. Like, legitimately, almost everybody I know, like, it's just, like, everybody has a weather alert radio. Why are you coming here to do a resupply? I to man, you don't, you really don't listen. I don't listen, dude. Sorry. You really don't. I said we were going to fly here because you can check the levels of both of your businesses while you're here. Oh! You coont. You're um, smart. So anyways, uh, it's hooked up to the, what's it called? The NOAA weather, uh, it's whatever the, the national, I can't even fucking think. There's, there's a, an abbreviation for it, but basically it's the system that sends out, uh, thunderstorm watches, thunderstorm warnings, tornado watches, tornado warnings, all that yeah. shit, right? So it's linked to mm -hmm. that, and any time that there is a warning or a watch issued, it will alert like that. So in, in my state, it's very important to have, because there's plenty of times where all of a sudden, 3 o'clock in the morning while you're asleep, uh, let's see, supply level, yeah, we're almost out, oh, on cocaine, so we need to go fill cocaine. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Um, I remember I like plenty it, of times dude. as a kid having to wake up um, because I grew up in a house without uh, a shelter of any kind. Like, we didn't have a cellar. We didn't have a basement. Um, so when anything happened, we had to drive to my grandmother's house because she had a basement. So I remember plenty of times mm -hmm. having to get up at, like, 3, 4 o'clock in the morning and shit and drive over to my grandma's uh, to take shelter because there was a tornado warning. Um, and if you don't have, like, a fucking weather alert radio or anything, especially back then when, like, smartphones and things weren't as prevalent, you know? Like, you just didn't know. Yeah. Like, a tornado is not like a hurricane where you have days and weeks in advance, you know, uh, knowledge that mm -hmm. that shit's happening. A tornado can just spring up and fucking, obviously, they're terrible. Yeah, so. hurricanes are all tracked <clears throat> and shit. And... Yeah, so, yeah, so weather alert radios are, uh, oh, God. Okay, we're good. Weather alert radios are, are a very common thing out here. And uh, where the fuck am I? I'm so disoriented right now. The lake's right here. Okay. You guys have, like, tornado shelters and shit, too, right? Or, like, spots yeah, in like houses the school, sometimes where you'll the, go and, like, the, hide from one? The school didn't have one. Yeah, like, there's supposed to be... You're supposed to, like, designate a room or a spot or whatever. Cause, I mean, it happens all the time. My town got hit specifically, like, a few years ago, and it was fucking terrifying. Yeah. Um, wiped out quite a few houses and everything. Like, I had people that I knew that were affected. But I remember that, when Joplin got hit, right? Didn't Joplin well, get hit? Yeah, and it was actually, like, right around the same time. But, uh... Yeah. <clears throat> so, um... But, yeah, like, when I was in school, we didn't have one yet. I went to a really small school, though. But now, yeah. the school that I went to, they, they have one. Like, they, it's pretty common for them to have tornado shelters out here. Just because it's mm -hmm. so... They happen so often. It's fucking terrifying, to be, often, to be honest, but... That's scary, dude. But real estate's cheap. Hey, I wonder why. Hey, hey. I wonder Jumping. why. <laughs> Steel supplies, confirm. Get this a will be nice because we'll have commando too. Everybody. Uh, oh, yeah, your supplies is low as hell. Dude, this yeah. is already ready to sell again, dude. You well, that's what I was saying. I, I literally filled level. this earlier today, bro. It's just from recording your episode and my episode that that's... Yeah. I mean, these episodes are long, like... A lot of shit can be made during the time that we do these episodes, like, dude, because we're on for like a solid hour and thirty minutes to do the episodes. Wait, do we have commando we have or do like, we leave them? Yeah, we got them. Yeah, so we do like 
30 to like 40 minutes for each of us and then we have like the downtime in between episodes which we're also in the server getting and then we got the prep like starting up like yeah. up driving to me to like start in one area we're on for like two hours or like an hour and a half every time we play so we're gonna make good money brewing, doing it. Dude. especially once we start streaming dude we're gonna be making money hand over dick dick over balls oh like hand over dick dude. did you notice what we've got right here though fucking tequila law oh fuck me <laughs> yeah are you gonna do that strat with a motorbike yeah, definitely. I did it earlier today. So just, yeah, so you guys know, I got on earlier today, actually, and uh, did a stock. I don't know if I mentioned this earlier. I feel like I didn't. But I stocked up off off camera. Um, I had, like, a business call. And uh, while I was in that call, I just loaded up GTA and fucking did some stock missions. And basically got both of my businesses up to full supplies. And that helped a lot. But goddamn, just from filming these episodes, our supplies are almost gone again. So, yeah, it's fucking crazy. He's crazy yeah, but i had insane, a tequila yeah. law earlier i did it solo i just put a sticky bomb on a bike i wouldn't wish there. a tequila law on anyone right 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 you're bloody well right oh fuck wrong block <laughs> i'm gonna order me a motorbike boom all right let me go oh, so you order the bike to come in there should i just go in there and start wreaking havoc yeah if you want totally fine all right I got the bike. I'll be in there in a second. Oh, that's not the door. Sticky bomb. Armor doesn't matter. Remember that. I'm out of armor again. I need to get some more. I wish you could buy that from your quick me uh, quick menu like you can ammo, but... No, I don't want to hit the prostitutes. It's a stupid game in their targeting system. Oh, dude. All of our boys are in here. Of us. Oh, I just killed Bobby Saget trying to kill someone else. Order a pizza. Oh, I died. Hey, uh, Commando got uh, some. Uh-oh, I'm getting hit. Ah, no, 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 no. Oh, but make sure you don't blow up any of the supplies, because two of them are already on the ground. Okay, I guess we're good. Fucking die, dude. Oh, it just oh, started no, raining outside. Oh, it sounds so pleasing. I hey, you shouldn't have ran in there yet, the bro. Fire. Oh, it's raining really hard. I think it's starting to hail. That's not good. Oh god, now I'm on fire. Okay. Do we have all three of them? Like, do you see me carrying some? Um, or my regular I think stuff? we all three have one, yeah. Because I don't do see I have any. One? Okay. God damn it, Speedy! You spread the fire to me. I just need to know. Do I have one? I don't know, bro. Don't. Yeah, you're blinking. You, on me. Okay, I'm blinking green. Fucking cunt! I don't know why you had to walk to me to ask that. I can't see personally if I have them. I know, but it's on the mini map, not. Well, I was gonna go upstairs and kill someone else. Your mom's a slut, dude. I didn't, I didn't mean that, bro. Where'd the helicopter... The fucking helicopter disappeared, didn't it? God damn it. Um, I'm gonna ask. One of the NPCs stole my buzzard. <laughs> damn it. Oh, oh there he, he spawned it back in. Okay. Okay, cool. You can order pizza. But I you can't can stop. always... Can't stop singing Wheeler, dude. Oh, uh... I hit up Wheeler, dude, and it sounds like an interview is gonna happen, bro. It was dude, funny. I told him. Awesome, I told him I was like, I was like, yeah. So I was like, I don't have a podcast or anything. I was like, but we can just like talk <laughs> for like an hour or more or whatever, and I'll throw it up on my channel. I was like, I should get some decent views. He was like, he's like, fuck yeah, dude, I'm down. I was like, all right. That's awesome, dude. So yeah, I have to like talk to his manager and go through him. Um, but oh really? It, it should happen, yeah. Like he's down to do it. He's just like. Um, Email my manager and he gave me his contact info, and I I've, yeah. I've talked to him a little bit but haven't ironed it all out yet. So, but the manager sounded like uh, like he was good for it too. That's awesome. Yeah. So that'll be fun. It was like talking to the manager, just like setting up time and shit, or um, not not yet. We, like I said, we haven't got that far in the conversation, but just preliminary talks. Like, hey, this is what we're thinking. What do you think? Blah blah blah. Okay. You know, send him a dick pic. All Sounds fun, shit. man. Yeah. I feel like an interview with him would be very interesting. Oh, yeah, dude. I'm looking forward to it. Are you like it. the one I'm kind of nervous, shit, though. Dude, are you going to write that's, down questions? That's my thing. Like, I've never done anything like this, so I'm, I'm like, nervous. That nerve-wracking, man. Good yeah, luck. Yeah, yeah. Like, I don't want to, like, let them down because, obviously, like, they're doing it to, you know, have a little bu bit of fun but also yeah, promote you... their new album. So, like, I, I, I feel yeah. like... Yeah, I feel like I should be a little structured. Like, I should come up with questions and everything. I It'd guess be this funny, is good... too, like... 
30 everybody minutes into the interview, you just like run out of questions, so you're just like, uh. Right. Uh. Every, everybody listening, uh, if you guys have any ideas for questions that I should ask Wheeler Walker Jr., let me know. Dude, it's starting to fucking. Can you hear this? It's starting to come down outside. I gotta close my window. I hear window. that, dude. It's dude, fucking, that's crazy. Right? God damn. It's still, you can still hear it just as loud. Yeah, it's definitely hailing. All right, guys. Well, uh, I probably need to take shelter. So uh, we've got a good <laughs> little supply run going here and a uh, decent amount of stock. I'm going to go outside and make sure that it's not baseball-sized hail or anything. And uh, thanks for watching the episode, guys. We'll catch you on the next one. Bye, everybody.